refuses to be pigeonholed or patterned. Do y'all hear me? You can't pigeonhole or pattern God. God always allows himself the freedom to work in a, in a unique way, however God sees fit. And it's wrong for us to try to find uh, different formulas for God. I think this is what these people are doing. God, do it like you always do it. We know that you did this before. Do it again. We like to find methodologies in different ways. So a better prayer probably would have been for them, God, do whatever you want to do. Here's our friend. Do whatever. Do what you do, God. Do whatever you want to do. Perhaps that needs to be the prayer of your life. God, do whatever you want to do, however you want to do it, whenever you want to do it. Not, you might not do it the same way that you did it last time, all right? We want to copy and paste God. <laughs> we want to copy and paste the things that he does in, in our lives. We want you to do the same thing you did last year, God. It's easy. Just do that one thing again. Wouldn't that be great if God operated like that? Like, you know the drill, God. Just do the same thing. Thing, But, you know, we serve a God who likes to switch things up. Maybe that's why Jesus did the extreme opposite. Jesus did the extreme opposite. Check it out. Jesus took this little guy aside, took him away from the crowd. I love this because there's some things that's just going to be between just you and God. There's some things that God wants to do for you and show you in a secret place. There's some things that God don't want to do in front of a crowd. God just wants to do it one-on-one with you. Jesus took him and took him away from the crowd. Perhaps this is what this pandemic was all about for some of us, to take us away from the crowd, away from the noise, away from the church, and really evaluate your own relationship with God, just one-on-one. What do you think about when you're all by yourself? What are the conversations you have with God when you're alone? Maybe God, and I love this, because Jesus initiated this. The little man didn't say, hey, Jesus, let's be alone. No, Jesus was like, hey, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Do you feel God beckoning you? Do you feel God drawing you? Come here, come here, come here, come here. I want to just talk to you, just by yourself. You don't need to call nobody. You, you really, you don't need to put this on social media. You don't need to post about it. I just want, I just want you, you and me. 